I'm going to call on Pearl Cleage. Pearl, come up here. Pearl Cleage is one of my favorite authors. And when I had this idea to do the Legends celebration, I thought, well, who better to call than Pearl to come up with something? I'd been trying to explain to people what the weekend was. And after we read the poem, everybody knew. Because we are free women, born of free women, who are born of free women, back as far as time begins, we celebrate your freedom. My sisters, we are gathered here to speak your names. You could not have been in each of our little black girl bedrooms watching us with that make pretend microphone. <laughs> as we lip sync to your latest hit when dinner was ready downstairs or prayed for your safety when our parents told us that you were somewhere fighting for our freedom and that it was dangerous work. I don't have to tell you how it affected every single woman in that place that afternoon. From you, we learned that love, like beauty, comes in many forms. You showed us what love looks like when it's perfect and when it isn't. You let us watch you looking, reaching, yearning, always moving toward the light of something better, truer, deeper. We speak your names. We speak your names. When the youngins were all saying, we speak your names, there wasn't a dry eye in the place. I mean, everybody was in tears. Maya Angel, Ruby D, Loretta Scott King, Cicely Tyson, Diane Ross. We speak your names. We speak your names. We celebrate your courage. We celebrate your spirit. We celebrate your genius. We speak your name. We speak your name. The poem, to me, was the central force of the weekend because Pearl was able to capture, in the words of that poem, every single thing my heart wanted to say to these women. And she called it, We Speak Your Names, and that's exactly what it was. It was, We Speak Your Names. Gladys Knight, Patti LaBelle, Roberta Black, Leah Time Price. We speak your names. We speak your names. I went fully prepared to say thank you. What I didn't anticipate was that they would be so grateful. I would speak to the young'uns in particular and tell you in 20 years, there are young black women who will be doing something like this for you, saying thank you. There's nothing greater than thank you. That's what you say to God, is thank you. Thank you.